Hey, what's up everyone? It's Jimmy with the JDM Pit. Today's vehicle is actually right behind me here. It's a 1996 Toyota Hilux Surf and it actually uh, is what we like to call the trifecta in the SUV in the off-road world and that is the fact that it is a four-wheel drive diesel with a manual gearbox. Guys, this vehicle only has 46,000 miles and is in 100 percent impeccable condition so we're going to walk around um, and then we're going to do an interior walk and uh, show you guys how this vehicle drives on our test drive and uh, we'll take it off road a little bit and show you how the four-wheel drive works and let you know our thoughts uh, however we're already impressed with this vehicle so our thoughts are going to be pretty darn good uh, guys stick around thank you for watching thank you for your support please like and subscribe and i uh, can't wait to bring you guys another video soon let's explore this awesome 96 diesel hilux surf <laughs> all right so here it is it's a beautiful evergreen pearl exterior from toyota on this hilux surf you'll notice those oem front bumper lights there very rare to get something with those already on it from that era and then the uh we had the wheels refinished actually on this vehicle um we had them completely powder coated they looked absolutely beautiful uh, on this vehicle and we also installed some falcon at4s um, on this uh hilux surf the body is in perfect condition there's very very minor nick here and there but nothing even to mentioned to be honest with you it's that that clean body is absolutely straight no paint work it's all original shines up real nice and of course it's got those beautiful jdm visors that are in fantastic condition it's also got this awesome front hood guard right here just love that it's in great condition you can see the shine on that paint it's absolutely beautiful all the way around so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna actually walk inside of the uh, the surf and take a peek inside and uh, show you guys some of the features that it has inside it's gonna be pretty standard this is the SSRX model and uh, show you guys that awesome ma ma manual gearbox and take it for a drive all right here we go so inside you'll notice the the door panel extremely clean the seats had seat covers on them they don't look like they've ever even been sat in to be honest with you there's the stick shift the four-wheel drive shifter center console and the dashboard is absolutely immaculate over here you have your up down rear window you have your idle up button here you have your front fog lights here which are those big uh, amber lights that you saw there and uh, on this side here you have your tilt wheel and over here you have your cassette player for you uh, for all of us 80s and 70s babies we still have cassettes some of you may or may not have them still but if you do you got a cassette player right there Let's take a look in the back as we enter the back here, you're going to notice just how clean the mats are down here, the center mat, the rear seats, and the adjuster up here. You can actually pull this and it'll adjust the back seat uh, for you. And down here you have a rear heater and a cup holder. And for all you smokers, there's a smoke uh, ashtray right there. So as we approach the rear here, we'll notice that awesome brand new tire and wheel on the back of the uh, surf. Now you open this basically as a little lever right here. You pull that and pull it wide open here. You'll notice there's absolutely zero rust on this uh, Hilux surf. As we look inside, you'll see the extra center cap, which is located right here. You have storage over here. And the whole back is in amazing condition, as well as the headliner here, guys. Again, not many features in this Hilux Surf. We'll take it for a test drive, let you guys know what we think, okay?
But one thing that we do love on these uh, Hilux uh, surfs and all of our JDM vehicles, they come with these awesome rain guards right here, these wind deflectors. And they just, I mean, they're in just amazing condition after all these years. Um, it's clear, they're not hazed out and just awesome. And it gives this vehicle just such a wider stance when you're looking at it. All right, guys, I think it's time to jump in this thing and take it for a test drive. But before we do that, we're going to start this uh, engine and let you guys uh, listen to it. So let's take a peek and see what's under the hood. All right, so here we are under the hood of this Hilux Surf. And this is the legend. This is the 1KZ uh, TE engine uh, by Toyota. This motor is uh, just an incredible uh, setup. I actually am running the same motor in uh, my uh, high ace uh, van and um, I've never had a single issue with it and the thing just keeps trucking along I mean this this motor is just in immaculate condition uh, just take a look at how clean it is all the way around absolutely zero rust the coating is still on all the nuts and bolts um, on all the all the mounts and brackets I mean it's just it's just amazing to me how this thing came in this condition guys kudos to our uh, contacts over there in Japan who we work very closely with uh, to provide us with these awesome uh, JDM vehicles uh, over here in the States. You'll notice this vehicle is the uh, dual battery uh, setup and uh, particularly I uh, love that not all of them have the, the dual battery setup so this one has that which is a nice little bonus. So guys uh, without further ado in just a second we're going to go ahead and give this uh, diesel engine a crank. All right here we go let's give it a start. There's that awesome sound. Go ahead and give it some uh, some revs. Just a nice, healthy 1KZ motor, guys. I can't wait to get this thing on the road. Let's take it for a test drive. Go for it. All right, guys, my favorite part of the video. We're gonna go ahead and start this Hilux Surf ready to go for a quick drive and then we'll take it down and show you guys how this four-wheel drive works Here. So, this uh this surf brings back a lot of memories for me when i was uh 19 i had a, a 1997 and uh of course the forerunner here in the uh in the states and uh it actually uh was one of my favorite vehicles i believe it or not made a lot of little accessories for it and Ended up driving it all up and down the uh, eastern coast of the United States and enjoyed uh, every mile that I put on it. I had the 2.7 liter four cylinder, obviously, because these were not available at the time. However, just getting in this vehicle and feeling just how solid the uh, the vehicle feels with the uh, diesel engine in it is just amazing to me. And uh, it's kind of a shame that we never received this vehicle here in the States. Uh, it's the type of vehicle that will just last you forever and ever. Um, everything is smooth on this thing. The air is ice cold. Everything is in great operating condition here and um, It just drives very smooth. You can barely even hear the engine running inside this cabin uh, Believe it or not. So it's not sure if you know most of you probably haven't driven one of these But for those of you that uh, have or currently do own them, you guys know exactly what I'm talking about How reliable this combination is here uh, Definitely a lot of fun to drive with the stick shift uh, right here. It kind of gives you something to do and puts all the power in your uh, in your hands. But definitely very very enjoyable uh, to drive. Very smooth actually. Of course it's got new tires and we just mounted and balanced them. And of course that plays a big part in it as well. But definitely a very smooth ride. No noises, no creaks. Just pretty darn solid. So we're going to actually pull off up here into the, the field and, and take it for a, uh, a quick spin in the field and show you guys how the four-wheel drive works, all right? We'll be right back. All right, we made it to the field here. We had to make a pit stop and get some iced tea over at the McDonald's, guys. It's hot down here in Florida. So we're in the field now, so we're going to go ahead and engage this thing in four-wheel drive. Show you guys the operation of the four-wheel drive system. So right now it's in two-wheel uh, two drive mode. And if we push this four-wheel drive button located right here, up here you're going to notice all four wheels are going to light up green just like they did 
and then we're going to be engaged into four high which feels very very nice and then we're just going to put it down here and flip it back and it should lock right in center there there we go so now we're locked in and if we want to engage this thing in four low we're going to put it in neutral here and shift it over and go all the way up to the top and now it's going to be a four wheel drive low and it's just going to be a torque monster so guys this thing shifted in and out very smoothly go ahead and disengage everything all the lights are off just like that no flashing lights and we'll head right on out of the field I'm very impressed with the four-wheel drive in this uh, in this uh, Hilux just a nice smooth ride overall all the gears the four-wheel drive links everything is just smooth no noises at all so we're gonna go ahead and get back up on the on the road here and uh, back to the office but uh, guys look uh, we do these videos uh, and we do these little walk arounds these quote-unquote reviews but we just basically want to show you guys what these JDM vehicles are all about uh, they're just very well taken care of um, the culture over there just has high respect for their things and they really take care of them and you know when we get them we buy very very high condition grade uh, we definitely don't go below a certain condition grade at all ever um, it's just part of our policy, but uh, these vehicles are generally extremely uh, compared to the models that we have here or what's available on our market here. So uh, if you're on the market and you're looking to buy a JDM vehicle, um, you know, we do sell a great crop of uh, JDMs. Our website is available uh, to look at, guys, at uh, prestigeimportstampa.com and, uh, you know, our uh, Facebook as well if you haven't gone there. You can go there and see some more of these JDMs here at the JDM pit. And I just want to thank you guys for your support, guys. We're going to try to grow this channel a little bit more. And uh, we'll keep giving you guys uh, some uh, some walk-arounds and test drives. And we'll explore some more. Uh, so stick around. We don't know what we're going to bring to you next. But uh, I'm sure it's going to be neat. Uh, we got some pretty cool, interesting, and rare uh, vehicles coming from Japan. They should be here around the 28th of this month, guys. So stick around. And uh, thanks again, and we look forward to seeing you on the next uh, vehicle. So let's explore together. Have a great day.